Arsenal were looking to cement their place in the top four of the Barclays Premier League when they faced West Brom at the Emirates Stadium on Thursday night. And they got off to the perfect start with just six minutes on the clock. Alexis Sanchez allowed to twist and turn and fire an unstoppable shot under the despairing dive of Ben Foster, his fourth goal in as many games. But he was nearly culpable of giving away a penalty when this attempted clearance struck the Chilean's hand. Referee John Moss decided not to give it. And just moments after that, West Brom hit the crossbar. Gareth McCauley's header as he took advantage of Arsenal's zonal marking. And the Gunners were thankful for the woodwork. They then stepped it up and created a succession of chances. Mesut Ozil's shot crept through the legs of Foster. He was fortunate that a defender was there to clear it off the line before Elneny cleared the crossbar with the follow-up. Foster made several really good saves on the evening, but there was nothing he could do just before the break when Sanchez flicked a delightful free kick past him. Sanchez has now scored or assisted in nine goals in Arsenal's last seven Premier League games. Referee John Moss had been at the centre of much controversy over the weekend and there was another talking point this evening when Elneny went over. It looked like a dive, but unlike Jamie Vardy at the weekend, he wasn't punished for it, no penalty either. West Brom had won just one of their past 11 Premier League away games and you could see why they were on the end of wave after wave of Arsenal attack and only Ben Foster really kept the score down. This save from Mesut Ozil. They've also struggled to score goals under Tony Pulis, averaging under a goal a game. And with finishing like this from Solomon Rondon, you can see why. As routine a night as Arsenal would have hoped for, they win it by two goals to nil.